It's a joy for us to have Dr. John Piper with us this evening at Resolved. Of everything I would want to say about my friend John Piper, it's probably he has been a prophetic voice for a generation like few people have, like few generations have been able to experience. And what makes Dr. Piper's ministry so profound in my own life is how simple it is. And let me explain that. In his preaching and in his writings, what ministers to my own soul is his ability to take lofty, grandiose theological pronouncements and truth and to put them in a way that is fresh and it's understandable. I can't tell you how many times I've read something in, in one of his books and thought, I think I knew that, but I'm not sure I did until now. The way he says things are so insightful and so fresh. You'll understand that uh, we're blessed tonight. He preached uh, twice this morning and got on two flights with a delay. And uh, the Lord answered our prayers and he was able to land here in Palm Springs to be with us tonight. Um, I'm thankful for John Piper because when I experience his preaching, when I experience his writing, he mysteriously disappears. And I find myself lost in thinking about him and being escorted into a new view of God. I'm so thankful for my understanding of the gospel and the depth and riches that, that have been uh, mined out and extracted by you, Dr. Piper. It's been very, very helpful. As you know, I like to read a bit of an introduction by quoting from our speakers. Just one little paragraph. And this might, this might be as good a summary of the heart of our friend John Piper as I know. He says, all that came into being exists for Jesus Christ. That is everything. Everything exists to display the greatness of Christ. Nothing, nothing in the universe exists for its own sake. Everything from the bottom of the oceans to the top of the mountains, from the smallest particle to the biggest star, from the most boring school subject to the most fascinating science, from the ugliest cockroach to the most beautiful human, from the greatest saint to the most wicked genocidal dictator, everything that exists, exists to make the greatness of Christ more fully known, including you and the person you have the hardest time liking. Dr. Piper, thank you for pointing us to the Christ, explaining the cross. We look forward to hearing you. Please welcome John Piper.